What is up, guys? This is Justin, a.k.a. FM Digi, and I am here with episode number 28, The American Hitchhiker. Um, Detroit City has been an awesome club, but it's time to move on. We have three different offers, and I'm taking one of them today, so stick with me. All right, guys, welcome back. As we went over in the intro we have a new home um, three different offers came in uh, applied to a few different jobs you saw me on twitter i put out a poll asking what do you guys think should i wait for jobs to come in or should i start applying for some um, i think it was 62 percent said go ahead and apply for some so i listened to the people you know you guys are who i do this for well me too a little bit but yeah so um whoops what's going on over here left a tab open sorry um, so I went and applied for some jobs and I got some, and I had a weird one come up and I'm not going to lie. I may have cheated a little bit because I went off and saved a different version, branched out to a different save because I noticed a bug with my database. So, um, anyone who's using my database, let me know if you've had a bug in league two, because right now it looks like some of the league two teams have way too much money and are in financial fair play uh, prison. So um, I noticed that in a, someone had mentioned it to me in a, um, a post on uh, the community page a while back in uh, SI Games. And I thought I'd fixed it, but apparently not. And I don't know how to fix it. So if you know how to fix fair play, financial fair play stuff that's happening, let me know down below. I would freaking love to talk to you because I cannot fix this. I've been trying to figure it out and I have no idea what to do. So um, just to kind of go over what we've done because where we left off last time is we won the league and finished this season out uh, here. Uh, let's see, I think we left off, yeah, these, these games right here. So since then, we've done some transfers for Detroit City. Also, in the meanwhile, uh, looking for jobs. But, you know, we brought in some good guys, and maybe we'll steal some good guys. Um, did some free transfers. Did my usual bring everyone in on a trial basis and see how they get on. But, um, you know, I was pretty happy with the preseason and summer and everything like that. So what I did, um, I know there's been a few of you who love the Detroit, D Detroit City series. Wow, that was hard. That was really hard to say. Um, so I've branched out and have a separate Detroit City save on my computer that um, will be before I leave Detroit City for American Hitchhiker. Remember, I mean, the series called American Hitchhiker, so the, the idea is for me to progress up as high as I can up the pyramid, and that's what I'm doing. So you see here, um, Hartford had approached me. I asked them for a delay because I had this in my e email um, for Tacoma Defiance. Now they also approached me. So I have these two job offers here. I will take one of these two today. Um, we'll look here at Madison. They are in the championship. Pick to finish 24th. So not the best. Um, but they have a million and a half dollars in the bank. They have a pretty decent uh, wage, um, sorry, transfer budget and wage budget is 16K. Um, a little bit low. I mean, I think that's what I was, in fact, that's what I'm doing at Detroit right now. Yeah, 16K. So, you know, consider I'm going up to the championship. That's kind of low wage, wage budget. Um, Hartford is the other team that came up. I'm unsure if I want to go to them. They do have a bigger budget, but they are in kind of financial disarray a little bit. They're only picked to finish 19th in the championship. So I don't know. It just, it feels like I don't want to walk into a situation where finances are all screwed up. Um, let's see. Their value is 11.3 and value of Madison is 13 points. So they're about equal on value, about equal on training, youth and reputation. Let's see. Two and a half star or one and a half star, one and a half star, half star. Let me go back to Hartford. Um, see what they're. So they actually have two star, one half. So a little bit better in the reputation, but the finances kind of bug me a little bit. Um, now, so then there's Tacoma Defiance. So, okay, we look here. 
actually let's go real quick to my contract i am currently making 1000 a week with detroit city so i mean obviously i want to get a raise but with you know i keep winning leagues let's look at the history uh where is it job history i mean i've won two league three leagues and been promoted every year i've been in so i feel like i'm a pretty good coach um currently my profile says i am almost two stars i'm almost done with my continental a license uh going in here i mean decent numbers not too bad so I got to think what would be best for my career. Do I go to the championship where I have two job offers or do I take this job? Now, transfer budget and payroll budget are out of control. They're also in League Two, but you can see here under transfer embargo due to financial breach of financial regulation, due to breach of financial regulations. This is where I think my database might be broken, and I'd love to hear from you if you've run into this. Uh, I will go into their finances. Uh, oh, it's right here. They have 36 million in the bank. They have a budget, transfer budget of 5 million that they can't use and payroll budget of just absurd amounts and they can't use them. If you look at other teams in this league, they're all under transfer embargoes as well. Um, I'm not sure what's going on. I looked through the database to see what is going on with that. I can't find anything that references financial fair play in the database. I used, um, if you're familiar with the pregame editor, I used just the basic editor. I didn't go into advanced settings and get too crazy with that. I had initially, but then I backed out because um, a lot of other under the cover stuff wasn't working. So, oh, Houston Dynamo Academy, that's the one in League Two to go with. Um, well, they have no money though. So I was a little concerned I'm a little concerned with this issue with the financial um, situation for these teams. So, I don't know. I feel like, you know, best career-wise is to not take the Tacoma Defiance one. Um, I had posted on Twitter the other day. I didn't get a lot of response though on it about um, what kind of which one would you do. I initially was going to take this job. But now that I've realized it's kind of a bug in my database, I don't know, it feels dirty that I kind of went ahead and, uh, you know, just holiday to see what happened. But a year in, I'm still in financial fair play, as is everyone else in League Two. So I don't think that would be a very fun save. So I'm going to decline this job. Um, and I'm going to take Madison. Um... They don't have a lot of requirements. They want me to be an established uh, championship team, want me to avoid a relegation battle. Um, you know, so there's 24 teams. I think we're picked, uh, Madison, forward Madison is picked to finish 24th. The players they have, I mean, they've even got great players in here. Um, so, so that says a lot. They have not a lot of under 23s. They don't have an under 21 or an under 18 don't believe it's hard to see so I feel like this seems to be the one they do have a partnership with Minnesota United um, it's like we can send players back and they're gonna send us players we don't have to play them get a friendly um, we share the scouting knowledge that I like uh, be able to loan players from us and uh, so we have you know a decent partnership um, kind of thing so I think I feel strongly with going with forward Madison. Um, let me know what you guys think. If you totally disagree and think I'm stupid, um, let me know. I mean, I like to hear. I like to hear it. It's one of those things where if I was just playing by myself, um, I wouldn't care. But you know, I do this for you guys. I want you guys to be, you know, to be feel like you're part of this. So I'm gonna go ahead and try to negotiate some out of here. Um, see if I can get, I'll stick with the two years, see if I can do 1.3. Um, right now, like I said, I'm making a thousand. So it's a 30% raise. If I can do this, let's try it one more time. No, they're not going to have it. Okay. I'll take the 1.2. Um, we've got a little bit of a battle here to go, but yeah, we will now, um, goodbye Detroit. I love you guys. I miss you. I'm going to miss you. But let's go, uh, hang out with Forward Madison FC. Uh, yes.
So they would pay Detroit City five grand. Um, yeah. Okay, we do have no general manager. We have an assistant coach founded in 2018. So they're a really new club. I like that. I like that so we can help write the history, get them back on pace. Um, again, we're going to do that. Uh, don't really want um, Sure. Okay, so here are in the last year of contract. We will get with them competition review. So they want us to avoid relegation, second round of the FA Cup, and the second round of the League Cup. Um, also, one thing I wanted to mention, I didn't really want to leave Detroit City high and dry, so uh, I forgot to show you guys. Um, actually, I think we can go back. Detroit City. Um, <laughs> um, they haven't done any friendlies yet, so they still have over almost a month before their first uh, regular season game. So I'm leaving them in plenty of in good hands, where they have plenty of time to get their um, get their stuff sorted. Who is oh, they don't have a coach interim coach yet. So you know, as um, also because I feel bad, you know, they're named La Rouge, which is red, wearing a little red shirt. Um, ignore what it is. I have no idea what it is. It's just a shirt. But uh, let's get in with Ford Madison. We'll call him Madison. Uh, we'll do tactics later. I uh, wonder if I can request any youth facilities. Yeah, that's what I was afraid of. Haven't been with you very long. Got one player who's unhappy, and he's freaking bomb diggity. Um, chat with them. Can I chat with? How can I chat with this guy? He wants to move to a bigger club, it sounds like. Well, I've got him under contract for the rest of this season, 825 a week. Um, worth 190k. Giddy up. Um oh, he might he might be screwed. I might be keeping him on. Like that. Um do you guys ever look at the social feed? I couldn't care less about it. Oh, <laughs> suggesting to unfollow Detroit City. So let's go ahead and look at the squad. Um, the finances. Let's see if I was to move this over and get thirty-six thousand a week instead of the eighteen thousand we get now. I think I did ask them for a little bit of a wage bump. So um, I think before I apply, I took the job. It said sixteen, but we got it to eighteen. So able to squeeze another two grand a week out of them. So that's not too bad. Uh, let's look at the staff. I don't have a GM, which I rely on often. Um, so I'll go ahead and get looking for that. Because, oh, godly knows I need help. Uh, place an advert for head of youth development as well, because I'm not that smart. Uh, you know, you need a good staff to do all this stuff. Yep, yep. Uh, let's see what else. Let's get to look at the looking at the team. Won't play any games today. We'll try to get you uh, get the team all sorted out. Um, so let's see who our top player is. Valdez, who is a striker. Chin can play um, left wing. Garza can play middle uh, attacking, and then Cohen. You can also play right. So maybe we can do a uh, four, two, three, one kind of thing. I don't have a lot of defenders here. I'm noticing. Ooh. Let's check out the youths. Um, yeah, I'm going to have to bring all these guys up. I hate this. This is the worst thing to click because you can't click. Now nah, give me another batch. You just have to kind of suck it up. So that's going to eat up a bunch of payroll. And then I got to get Mike Price in here because I believe he's my only right right back. Yeah, so he's going to get a new contract or a contract. Let's actually hit forward here to see kind of what that does for me. Um, okay, everyone signed their contracts, 140 a week. Ugh, I hate those appearance fees. I wish I had an option on that. Okay, let's look and see what we can do. Uh, squad. 
let's see what they recommend for a tactic. They have control possession, tiki taka, wing play. I don't think we have any, yeah, we don't have any sort of play they want us to do, make progress on and off the pitch. Uh, competitions come in in the, they want us to get to the second round. We enter in the second qualifying round, which I think we got to win two matches in the FA Cup and win one in the League Cup just to make the board happy. Um, relegation battle, we're picked to finish 24th, which is rock bottom. Only have to finish ahead of uh, three teams. What is the season preview has us? What? Oh. One of those things where we don't get shown on here because we are an affiliate club. Hmm. Okay. Regardless, uh, we might not be able to get promoted because, yeah, Minnesota United is up. So this might be an interesting play. Um, you know, because there are so many affiliated clubs, I knew eventually I'd run into one and have to deal with that. So we'll do that. We'll deal with that. Uh, let's look at the Dev Center, see our under 23s. Uh, do we have any information on these guys, star ratings wise? One guy with some potential, Mike Potts, 21. Not really any other potential in there. We have a bunch of, st not a lot of defenders. Okay. So what we will do is we will go ahead and try to find, let's see, scouting wise, who do we know? We don't know any, oh. Uh, clear this out. So I guess these are the players that they've scouted before I wandered through the door. Uh, this guy may not be bad. Defender. Really need to bring in defenders. I don't have anyone. Any budget's pretty, pretty shot. Um, let's look to see what this guy will come in for. Can we get him in? Loan him, get him on loan. Mm, really don't want to pay 500 grand for a guy who's probably not going to be a starter. Get that to 100. It probably won't. Come down. Let's try 100 again. No. Cool. Okay. Uh, that's not going to happen. Um, I have to scour for some freebies. Who do we have here on the list? Oof. Can I bring this guy in on loan? I mean, he's awesome. I mean, okay, so that won't happen. Whoops. Nope. I uh, do want to look at Club Info, Affiliates. Let's look and see Minnesota United. Who can we take from them? Take Borrow. Um, oh, good. They don't have anybody in their unders. Goalkeeper. Two goalkeepers. Under 18s, they have one player, Jordan Stewart. Midfielder. So we'll see if we can take him. What? What's his deal? I don't know. Um, I bring. I can't bring him on a trial, can I? Yeah, guess I can. Okay. Um, Try bringing Jimenez on a trial. See if they'll come in. Let's just next through this a little bit. Light is really upsetting me with that line. Goes math this right. The line that goes right there. Okay, let's see what they said. Okay, they did accept the offer for both those guys. Unfortunately, they're both goalkeepers, so that doesn't really help me out too much. Um, oh, this is a guy I tried to get when I was at Detroit City, and he was not having it. 
if I can get him now. Not that good. I mean, we were a National League premier side. Now we're a championship club. Marking is an area of concern. Let's actually look at this. Uh, we have really conceding. Oh, good. The uh, tactic I he just flat out mentioned to heaven. We need to get it right back. Um, yeah, let's figure out a tactic first. Since we are going to be kind of uh, one of the worst teams, I kind of like the control possession idea. Um, hmm. I'm going to let the co I'm going to let my assistant coach kind of dictate this, but I felt like that looked better. Let's just see what this does and if I don't like it then uh kill it. So Wonka is a left a defender. He can play. He can do wing back. Chin. Okay, he's an attacking uh left Guy who's going to play right wing back and really there's no one else who can play that I feel like we're not playing them um, I'm going to clear this out I don't like this whoops yeah, yeah okay let's go here create tactic and then control possession yep choose formation 4231 four, we're going to delete this one here I don't like it and this will be the one we'll go with, um, kind of start with and see where we'll build off of this. this. This takes our best players, puts them in the positions they're more natural at, um, utilizes them. I really got to get Anita right back big time, center back as well. Um, let's just expand this to the under 23s. Does that change anything? It gets me Bell. One star. So yeah, I mean, we definitely need some help. So here, all positions. Got everyone included. Yeah, so I mean, we're decent. Decent up front. I'm happy with how we're at front, but then from there on, it's pretty shysty. Maybe we can bring in one of those goalkeepers from Minnesota that might work. Um cool cool oh boy we're gonna have problems aren't we oh man they want to give me 250 up front 325 total there's no interest in joining them i'm going to reject this one, I think we might be able to get more. Hopefully that doesn't unsettle him. Good. All right. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do some uh, moves. I'm going to do some finagling offline and deal with that. And I will come back next episode, first game of the season with Ford Madison FC. Thank you guys so much. That was episode number 28 of the American Hitchhiker. New club. I'm excited. Forward Madison FC will be a fun time. I will miss Detroit FC, Detroit City FC. Detroit City, you know, just Detroit City. Wow. Um, too many FCs in my brain. Um, but the idea of the series is to progress as a coach, um, move on as quick as we can up the ladder. So that's what we're doing. Um, I am going to save... I do have the Detroit series saved before I took the job. So maybe down the line we can revisit this series and come back. Or, you know, if you guys want me to, I can try three series on here. That's kind of tricky for me um, to do. But let me know what you want. Uh, hit down below. Comment down below. Um, really appreciate the love. But also, if you haven't subscribed yet, please consider throwing me a subscribe. I'm so close to 100. In fact, by the time this video is out, I might be at 100. I don't know. Right now I'm at 95 as I record this, so I'm super excited, impressed, happy, loved, all that good positive things from that. That's so cool. Um, also hit the notification icon next to the subscribe to be notified when I do post new videos. And smash that like button because this is a big episode. You know, new club. We're, we're doing it. We're in the championship. I feel like we've earned this. Um, five years into our journey, we're already in the second tier of U.S. Pyramid. 
you know, we can only go up from here. So thank you so much, guys. Have a great rest of your day.